On June 6, 2020, I went on my first protest. Because we had three recent deaths, and one of the deaths is Odman Aubrey. He was just jogging. He was doing his regular jogging, doing his regular exercises, until two white men stopped him. Even though he was just jogging, he was trying to get through. But the two white men killed him. Another death we got was Rihanna Taylor. And she was just a friendly, regular person. But policemen and policewomen were trying to figure out where this criminal lives so we can stop them. But they mistaken it from Brianna's home. And they never, they never had second thoughts on it. They never rethink really about it. So they went in to Brianna's home and killed her in her sleep. And now, I think this one is the... Uh, the popular death that we gotten, and that one is from you know, George Floyd. Somebody sent George a fake, fake check money, and the police arrest him. And George went like under this car, and he was in cuffs. And a white policeman put his knee on George's neck. For eight hours. Eight hours. And George was trying his best to get out because he, he couldn't breathe. But he couldn't get up because he had he had cuffs all over his hand. So all the bystanders were like, please stop. He can't breathe. He can't breathe. And he stood there. The policeman just stand on, kept his knee on his neck. And the policeman was standing there like, there's nothing going on. There's, it's fine. It's all right. And then when eight hours were up, he finally took the knee off his neck and George died. And before you all say it, there are a lot of people that say lives do matter. That's true. But I feel like black lives should, you know, should be heard more because we're all equal. It doesn't matter. If you're from China, it doesn't matter about your skin color. It doesn't matter what accent you got. We're all living as an equal. So here's my advice to all my friends. For all my friends that are black, don't stop. Keep that voice. You need your voice because you need to be heard. And everyone needs to know that we as black people do matter no matter what. And to all my non-black friends, if you support Black Lives Matter, I am totally grateful and thank you so much. It means so much to me and my family. And keep, keep on supporting us. If you see anyone that's talking about racism or making a joke out of it, tell them to stop and fix it because it's a way it's a way to show that we all are equal. We're all equal. And black lives do matter. If there's no justice, there is no peace. Let's work together to get all the peace we need, all the justice that we need for Aubrey, Rihanna Taylor, and George Floyd. Black lives matter. No peace. No justice.